Hello YouTube, this is Don from Dare to Be Creative and I have a small haul from Tuesday morning and one thing from Ollie's. I got a, um, what a size is this? 18 by 22. This is a chalkboard slash magnetic chalkboard, excuse me. And it does have a scratch on it. So I'm trying to think of that scratch going to come off my board or should I keep it in that? But anyway, so that's what that is. I don't know if you can see it because it's so close up. But I'm going to hang that on the wall. And I want to use some clips with there to hang up some of my stuff. Anyway, so I did get a couple things before I started the, the thrifty spend with a quart spice. That I just didn't show in the haul because it was before we had started. And it was just a few couple smaller items. So I'm going to show you those first because I already had these. I just didn't do them in the haul. I got some more of the Precision um, American Crafts markers. They were on clearance markdown, and I like these because they really write nicely. And I think it's with the weekend when they had a 25% additional off of the 20%. So of the $3.99, I forgot what I paid. I think I paid two something for those five pens. But I like to use these precision markers like when I stamp something or fill something in or whatever, just writing, journaling on the page. I also had already gotten the um, Graphic 45, but you've seen these stamps. And that one as well. So that one and that one. And I had also got these, which, you know, Walmart sells these. If you can't find them on Tuesday morning, all the different brands, the different fonts they have, they are a pain in the butt because when you pull them apart, a lot of times the bottom pieces come off. They don't always stay adhered. But this was a different font. But the key, the Kai brand, it's in Walmart if you ever want to find those, even if you can't find them on your Tuesday morning. And I think they're the same as 89 or 99 cents in Walmart. And these are 99 cents, so same price. So, and then I think this, the My Road little spools, which I showed in the um, Prima Doll collab that I used for the little bottom steps up here. Um, I got those for that. And then the other thing I had got before the collab started was these little buckles. Hopefully to keep these. I use these for like um, mini album closures. And I had got this also in clearance, which was some napkins. It has um, New York and Paris travel by air. So I hope to use that in a layout. So that was what I already previously got. So then I went this weekend and I got, which I did not need any more paper. I did not need any more paper. It's only 12 sheets. I don't even know why I meant to put this back, but somehow it stayed in my cart and I didn't put it back. It was the Seven Gypsies, and this is um, double sided paper, but I thought it would be so cute to make some bags out of. And you know anything with dress warm, but it's just too cute. It's hard to get that up. Oh, yeah. I forgot. Also, I got this off of clearance, too, when I had shopped the other week. And that one, I think I was a dollar and. It had been like a dollar twenty nine, and it's just got a dragon butterfly, some wheels, some cogs on it, and some hot air balloon. All right, so the other thing I got was the little bee paper flowers. They had the, the paper flower kits, you know, the 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 stems and the petals and everything. And these are just the wires. I got these because I already have a flower kit with the punch board, and um, that I use the We Are Member Kitty punch board, but I can use some more stems when I make the flowers. And for 79 cents, that was a good deal. They had a ton of the Little Bee transfers for 79 cents. So I just got pretty much one of all of them except the Halloween because I don't do Halloween. But it says Happy. That's just some different go foiling. Sorry about the shadow because it is like a noon. And it's casting the shadow. And this one says Congrats. And this one says, for you, and they actually do have different numbers on them. I thought they all were the same. This one says, love. This one says, hello. And that one says, thanks. So the numbers run 183161 for hello, two for thanks, three, I just saw three. Three was congrats, four is for you, five is love. Six is happy birthday. And then on the end, 72 is just the um the gold ones. Then I got a couple stamps too, a little bit. I got a boy and a girl one. Because you know I always doing mini albums. 
And they were 79 cents as well. I got some more of the little metal ones by um, Can Company. Two of those. They've been out before. I just decided to get them this time. Then a lot of the jelly bean stuff. And um, I got some of these cards, the family note cards. And again, I thought these would be cute for pockets and mini albums. I'm trying to see how big this is. This is a little less than three inches. About three and a quarter. So these would be cute to make some little pockets. And there are the 12 different designs on the back. And they're 99 cents, and they're called Family Note Cards, 1810660. I also got two of the um, file cards, and these are 1810664, they were 99 cents. These I thought would be cute for the Rolodex, as well as tabs and a mini album. Well, just to decorate as an embellishment as well. They had a whole bunch of tags. I put a lot of the tags back. They had a lot of 49 cent tags, which were just regular cut tags on gold or silver paper or on colored paper. And I thought about them, you know, with the string, which is a 12 or six pack, which was good for 49 cents. That's not bad at all. But I said, you know what? I'm in a scrap collab. Let me use some of my scraps and use them as giveaways. So instead of buying them as giveaways. But I did get these, the boy and the girl tags, because again, I do a lot of mini albums. And I thought they were just cute. So that is the little boy. Aren't they cute? That's thin. But you can layer them or put them on the paper. And that's the girl. One of the therapists I work with, speech therapist, she's pregnant with a little girl. Um, and this is a notebook tag. So I'm going to have to make her something. And this one is um, notebook tag funny. 1810624 and it's 99 cents. So these are some of the scenes on the back of that. If it'll focus. There we go. Probably still can't read them. But it says laugh out loud. When in doubt, dance it out. Stuff like that. Just a little fun stuff. And two little 49 cent stickers. Both are about school. Probably don't need any more of these stickers, but I got them. Then I got a couple of the little B. There were quite a few more. I turned them down. Didn't get them. Like the arrows one. Um, I already had that one. The airplane one. I wasn't sure if I had it in that with the little envelope. For some reason, I think I already have it. But I didn't get it. It was only $5.99. But I decided not to get it. Even if I don't, because I have all those cuts on my Cricut. But I still kept debating on it. I have been wanting this a while, way a while back. And I never got it. But it was $8.99, the, the triple punch. And that's one eight zero three three seven, the ticket punch. So I got that. Because that one is kind of harder to duplicate on your own. Because I don't think I have anything on my Cricut that does that one. It might be one of the design space, but I'm talking about the cartridges that I own. I did get um, another set of plates for $5.49. I thought it was $4.99, but it's $5.49. I missed that. But anyway, two cutting plates for your Sizzix, and this will go in my um, Big Shot Plus. So yay, and I'm pretty sure that'll fit my Cricut as well. But at least I know it goes in Big Shot Plus. I can always use plates. Then I got some of the other dies. They had some more. They had the ones with the cards, um, with the for A2 cards in the bottom had print on it like Chevron and a butterfly. They had another one. Uh, it was another A2 card like that. I forgot. I didn't get them. And I don't know what made me get these two right here. These were more of the A2 ones. But I like them because you can make folders as well as an A2 card. So these would be good for little gift cards, gift tag cards, and ATCs. That was my thinking with these. Um, this one has seven in it and the $7.99 is called Little B Polka. You really can't always see what's inside of these things. So I love the way they package them because they come already on a magnetic strip. So, and then they give an illustration of right here what's in there. So you have it. So that plate, you can take the inner out as far as if you wanted to cut or not cut or just so that can be an embossed area. So that's the different ones that you have to give you the dimensions on it. So I really do appreciate about Little B dies that they do that. So that's an ad. That's a... ATC size, two and a half by three and a half. Again, also mini cards for, um, you know, birthday bags and stuff like that. If you want to put a little card on it, you know. So this one is Little B Confetti, and this one was $7.99 as well. This one has 16 pieces in it. And at first glance, you don't think it's 16 pieces, but it's because it has a lot of little words that you can emboss in there. They don't cut out, but they emboss. 
So and I'll read you those words in a minute. So this is basically the same thing, same, same thing um, but it can make the folder and the two different tags and then you can nestle the circles inside of it. But these squares, these words also fit in here. So I checked that out. So that was pretty cool. So I can also use it on that die. So let me read you the words that you can embark with again. Don't you drop it. Of course, I just did. I found it. That's a miracle. You know when I drop stuff on my floor, Lord have mercy. Anyway, it says, the, the sentiments um, for you, love you, congrats, and thank you, you and me. Please come just because you're invited, thinking of you, and happy birthday. So how perfect is that to make some cards out of? So that's one of the things I want to make with that. Or you can make ATCs as well. And then the last one is the sentiments. And that was only $5.99, so that was a good deal. So six sentiments in here. And that's how big they cut out. So the sentiments is you and me. Thanks a bunch. Let's eat cake. You can do this. I'm so happy for you. And hello. So I thought they were pretty good. And they already welded together. So I like that. So that is the end of my haul. Still, I did pretty good. I mean, I did good. You know, I'm still, my hauls are still smaller than they used to be. So I'm still trying to be conservative. I turn now a lot. Like I said, there were quite a few more little bee dies. And um, I didn't get every single one of them. So I'm proud of myself for that. And I didn't get all the punches because they had a lot of the border punches if you're looking for them a little bit. And I didn't get those as well. And um, they brought out a lot more of the Sizzix, the Biggs dies. I didn't get any of those. So if you're looking for some of those, they have the new machine. I didn't get the machine. So I'm still spending, but I, I do take the time to think a little bit more about what I'm getting now. Trying anyway. I still probably can put you know stuff back, but I'm making baby steps and I'm proud of the stuff I've made this year because my budget has been nice <laughs> that I have spent so much less this year. So that much I can definitely tell. So anyway, check us out for the Sunday Thrifty Collab um, and using the past scraps. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Take care. Bye-bye.